Welcome to Survive the Fall, a game where you can actively control three characters. Let's dive into the adventure. In battles, you can always rely on your companions, whether you opt for a stealthy approach or not. Once the area is cleared of any threats, it's time for looting. In the beginning, your settlement lies in ruins. You must rebuild it from scratch and seek vengeance upon those who oppressed you. Battles are challenging, yet fear not for by your side stands a companion to whom you can issue commands in planning mode. For example, you can instruct your companion to take the first shot with a ranged weapon, targeting enemies who are armed likewise. Survive the Fall offers engaging quests that will present you with some tough choices. As you scavenge for resources, remember that your efforts benefit not only yourself, but also your settlement. I'll tell you more details about this shortly. In our recent expedition, we managed to collect a lot of interesting stuff, including valuable notes that we will use to acquire knowledge points. I'll immediately tell Zack to examine them. While the rest of the settlers attend to the cleanup of the raid aftermath. After Zack finished examining the notes, we had some excess technology points left. Let's allocate them toward rope making and constructing a chemical lab. Okay, now we can build it. In the meantime, let Jack collect wood. It will be very useful for building more structures. Now let's make some ropes, which will come in handy during our expedition. There are two ways to venture into the open world. You can either wait for the day to end, or you have the freedom to embark on your journey at any given moment. The choice is yours to make. Now it's time to find Liz, a member of our community who was abducted during the raid on the settlement. Rally your companions and embark on a mission to bring her back safely. It's time to immerse yourself in a post-apocalyptic world full of secrets. <laughs> 